I'm Junior Teacher. Making these inspirational videos is not easy. It takes about 45 minutes to make one. What with the time it takes to come up with a teaching idea, to practice what I'm going to say, and actually record a video. One particular challenge is how to protect the identity of the people in my life whose stories I tell. Most of the time, I simply change a little small detail like the setting of the story or the gender of the person to make it difficult for people to guess who it is I'm talking about. And for the most part, I've been quite successful. I've made 100 and over 150 videos and only had three people come to tell me that something I said made them uncomfortable. The first person allowed me to keep the video up, but reminding me gently to be more careful in the future. The second person allowed me to re-record the video while omitting a small piece of information. And still a third person politely asked me to remove the video, which of course I gladly did. You know, I don't want to hurt anybody's feelings, I just want to inspire people. And why are stories so inspiring? Because it is in the stories of our daily lives that we hear about what it means to be human. And if there is one thing common to all of humanity, it is the fact that we make mistakes. Like me not being careful enough with information. But when you make a mistake, you just apologize and you take the necessary steps to make it better. That's what being wise is all about. This semester in Hebrew, just last night in class, we've been talking about the wisdom books of the Bible. And we were talking about how there is one thing common to all people of wisdom. It is that they are teachable, that you can teach them because they want to learn and they want to get better. The Bible has a lot to say about fools too. Namely that uh, they are not teachable. You can't teach them because they don't want to get better. So as you weather on in your life and get along in your years, I hope you become increasingly more wise. I'm Eugene, the teacher with today's inspirational message.